All right, so I see the problem that's happening with this particular piece of art here. Let's take a look. We have the uh, fox hollow uh, situation here. So what we have is this uh, outside circle here, and then we have this inside circle here. I'm going to put those back. All right, so the problem with this is if you were to try to union this to this, this is its own circle. Um, that would be, and it's really hard to describe it in any other way than... Um, this letter is already filled in, so if you're trying to take something filled in and attach it to something that's filled in, it's just going to remove it from the entire screen. So what you need to do is actually create something called a donut. So you click on the inner circle, hold shift, click on the outer circle. And what you're going to do is delete this inner circle from the outer circle. That's the only way that this is going to work. So we go path, and let's see difference here. Oh, and that does not do the trick. Interesting. All right. Let's see what this looks like here. This is, well, well, let's find out what's going on here. It looks like this particular circle doesn't want to work the way that most of these normal circles do. Let's grab this circle from down here. Since it is the exact same size, we're going to delete this circle here. We're going to grab the circle that you had previously for this specifically and try this with this particular one. Here we go. Click on the inside, hold shift, click on the outside path and difference. There we go. See, now we've deleted the inside, which is what we want. Now we can actually click on this letter, hold shift, click on the outside and path union and it joins it together. That is the only way. You have to delete the inside for that to work. But again, that's only in this particular use case. And you have to have this donut-like shape. Again, you may have other files that may encounter this. You just have to always be sure that you're adding or unioning into negative space or space that isn't taken up by um, a filled vector already. So, again, to go over this, and I don't even have to use this particular circle. It could be any circle that you make except for the one that you already had there because there was something uniquely wrong with that particular circle. Um, probably because it was unioned already previously. That would be my understanding. I'm not sure. But I would set one circle on the inside. You have the exterior circle there. You click on one, hold shift, click on the other. And you go to path and select difference. It'll delete the center. Then you can union to the outside. And that'll get you going.